I kept playing slow pitch softball and I kept getting hurt. You know, knees, shoulders, every, you name it, man, I heard it, okay? So I said, well, what's, it was on the bases that was killing me. So I, um, so I said, all right, so I stopped playing wiffle ball. I go to Petco, and if you go up behind the outfield, they have a wiffle ball field, right? And I'm like, I gotta, I gotta have this. My son kept saying, Dad, you gotta build Ebbets Field. You gotta build, not build Fenway. And we went there, I'm looking at Fenway, I'm saying, man, but this would be so good. But he was right, we needed something different, I think. And I think if you look at the field, it's unique. And even though like the new fields are like, they, they're not cookie cutter anymore. They're not unique though. I thought this was gonna be six weeks and done. <laughs> Did not happen that way. We broke ground in late February. In May, we finished most of the construction on the field. And then it was, and then we hired a landscaper. But he finished up everything sometime into late June early July. The rules are right now a combination of a lot of other rules that I've, you know, and I've adapted some rules that I liked and, um, and got rid of other rules I didn't like. Five balls is a walk, which makes, basically makes you have to throw a strike, you know, and then two strikes is an out. Uh, and then we got four fouls, you know, because you can keep fouling the balls off. You know, as a pitcher, you know how frustrating that can be, right? And then we wanted to get rid of the, the cheaper hits or the non-hits. So it's got, the ball's got to reach the pitcher's mound to be, a, to be considered a ball in play. Anything caught in the air is an out. You can throw, if, after you catch it in the air, you can hit the box for double play. And I think it's a good rule. Uh, it's got to hit the wall for a double. Gotta go over for, for home run, obviously. And then we got the mesh, which is the uh, mimics of its field. That's a triple. This is something that's for my family and friends, and you know, I'd love to meet some new people, you know, who wanted to play ball. My son and I would play probably six games or so a week, five to six games a week, as many as my mom can handle. I wanted to create something where 15 years from now we can look back on our career statistics. You know, I love the game, obviously. <laughs> you don't build this if you don't love the game. Oh, it's a ball! <laughs> I'll take that. <laughs>